All right, KTC, here we are in the hottest week of the year. <laughs> if you've been doing any training this week, congratulations. Stay safe, stay hydrated, and uh, hopefully it gets a little more manageable next week. But um, looking at last week's leaderboard, might as well kick it off with that. Huge congratulations. First time, I think, on the top. Vanessa, 15 hours, 43 minutes. Woohoo! <laughs> Well done. Uh, Ron taking second place, 13-13. That's a lucky number for you. <laughs> uh, nicely done there. And uh, I actually made the podium this week. Quite happy about that. In terms of total distance, uh, Dustin putting in the most distance of the week. Congratulations. I imagine lots of riding still going on. Uh, Rob, number two, nicely done there at 291K. And Vanessa, number three. And then looking at longest activity, Ron crushing it with a five and a half hour workout. Congratulations, killer ride. I know it didn't go as well as you were hoping to, but uh, <laughs> got the time. Uh, Vanessa, 414, amazing. And Rob Swan, just over four hours. So nicely done there. In terms of time in the, uh, in the water, Troy... Still representing from out east, uh, 3 hours, 33 minutes. Uh, Kate, number two, nicely done, 3.14. And Vanessa, number three. Ride time, again, I'm going to guess. Oh, Ron, number one. Uh, Matt, number two, nice. And Rob, number three. And run time, we got uh, Vanessa putting in the most time of running. I came in second. And uh, Dustin, number three. So congratulations, everybody. Now on to the big news of the week. We are back in the pool. It was so nice to see everybody yesterday morning. Uh, those of you that uh, couldn't make the first one, no worries. Going to see you next week. It's going to be great. Reminder, don't show up tomorrow. No swimming tomorrow. But I will put an invite out there if anyone wants to go for a 6.30 a.m. swim down at Gyro for a few loops. I'll be down there. So want some company? or I want some company, feel free, uh, join me for that. The water should be nice and uh, toasty. Probably going to go no wetsuit, but uh, I'll leave that up to you. So, um, again, back in the pool next week on Tuesday. Uh, we are going to be continuing on with the, uh, the program. There may be some changes in terms of restriction loosening, but I'll be... Uh, conversing with the H2O Center to see if there's any, uh, you know, changes to the mass policies or distance policies or anything like that. Uh, if there are, I will let you know. Uh, there may or may not be, so uh, we'll see. Or there may or may not be on, you know, next week. It may take some time uh, for those things to change uh, for the operator to make those changes anyway. Um, but again, awesome just to have everyone back. Uh, see you grinding it out in the pool again, pushing each other. Um, no lifeguards got, uh, wet. So that was a complete success in my books. So last thing I wanted to talk about today was a couple of the, uh, summer mock try events, uh, because we don't have any racing was hoping to put on uh, a couple more little races like we did with the cherry blossom and the Oliver. Uh, we are limited to, I believe, 5,000 people now, so we have to keep the numbers below that. I think we'll be okay, but um, we will do some uh, Facebook groups or Facebook events uh, and Strava events. Either one, you can jump on uh, and indicate whether you're going or not. I'll be throwing up some uh, routes and uh, some videos of just... Uh, uh, the location so you can get a kind of a sense and a feel for where we're uh, going to be racing. Uh, we're going to try out Cedar Creek uh, Park. I know it's a dog park, <laughs> but the water was really clean when I went there the other day. And, um, you know, uh, all our sewage goes into the water eventually. So uh, anyway, um, it was uh, very nice in terms of lots of parking. Uh, really nice swim course, about 600 meters of boys down, and uh, obviously that would make for a wonderful 1,200 meter swim. Uh, really nice opportunity to bike Lakeshore, so heading out to Cedar Creek Park. And I should qualify, there are two parking lots. There's the upper one and the lower one. We're going to be in the lower one. Um, it just works a lot easier for transitions and things like that. You don't have to run up a big hill. Um, so 
again, meeting would be down in the lower one. Uh, we can, uh, again, swim right off the course there, uh, bike right out onto Lakeshore, do a Lakeshore to the end and back, all the way back up to, um, you know, the corner of, uh, of Lakeshore and Shoot Lake Road at the lights there, and then turn around and go back. About 22 kilometer bike, and then uh, heading out on the run, we can follow uh, the trail along Cedar Creek Park and then head up and again take the run out to the traffic lights at uh, Shoot Lake Lakeshore and back. And again, that's going to give us about a 7K run with uh, good varying terrain. So would be a ton of fun for a little sprint-ish triathlon, sprint plus, I guess. Uh, obviously, we can take those uh, distances and double them if we uh, want to do some longer ones in the future. But right now, I have this one earmarked, not this upcoming weekend, but the following weekend. So again, if you want to jump into that, check out Facebook, check out Strava. And um, even if you're doing long stuff, it's really good just to go through the motions of swim, bike, run, uh, organizing all your gear. <laughs> I forgot how much time and effort it took uh, just to get everything organized and ready for a triathlon. Uh, going through the race day mornings and getting everything set up and organized. Again, if you can take that... Um, out of the equation because you've practiced it a whole lot showing up to Ironman Canada if you're doing that race um, again you're gonna go through those exact same motions it just takes you a little, lot longer for each discipline so um, again really good practice um, and uh, it should be a ton of fun so again check those out hope you can join in and uh, we'll do a couple rips uh, on a few of these weekends over the summer to make up for some of these lack of racing and it's nice and close and local and the price is right <laughs> It's free. Anyway, that is it for this week. Again, congratulations to all the leaderboards. Uh, keep on working. Stay safe in this heat, and we will talk to you soon. Actually, I'll see you in the pool soon. Tuesday, to be exact. Unless you're not swimming. Then what's wrong with you? If you still want in on swimming, you still can. Hit me up, and I'll make sure uh, you get a spot. Anyway, there's only a few left. We'll talk soon. Have a great week.